of Ukrainian scientists on a mission to save the planet have narrowed their focus to their own families. CTV's Tom Walters on how a Russian invasion altered their outcome. They are a long way from home. But for members of a Ukrainian research team, even Antarctica is not far enough to be untouched by the Russian invasion and much too far to be away from loved ones. All our families was under threat. The emotions overwhelming. Anger, despair, helplessness, frustration. For one thing, they were stranded. After nearly a year at the Ukrainian station, their return was delayed for another two months. While they passed the time, only the local wildlife seemed unconcerned or relaxed. And the work, climate research to benefit all of humanity, was suddenly overshadowed by inhumanity. The work at the station was almost paralyzed. The only way to join the war effort from here, posting messages aimed at the Russian scientists who follow them on Facebook, urging them to speak out against Putin's atrocities. Only now are they finally aboard a ship for the long voyage back. I've come to terms with the fact that my life will never be the same. The team doctor's new life will be caring for injured Ukrainian soldiers. But even among the scientists in Antarctica, he could see a few wounds of war. It led to the blood pressure spikes and insomnia. Blood pressure spikes and insomnia. Confirmation by researchers that heavy hearts and sleepless nights are following Ukrainians, literally to the ends of the earth. Tom Walters, CTV News, Los Angeles. And it all looks so calm. That's it for us tonight. And Lisa Laflam, for all of us at CTV National.